Hey guys, today I'm here, we're starting our garden today, and I'm planting beans and peas, and we just planted our tomatoes, and we've got our onions that we planted probably about two weeks ago that are coming up nice and pretty, and we're just getting our uh, garden started this year. So right now, I'm gonna plant our Kentucky Wonder pole beans. So we have our cedar right here. All right, guys, so Alex is going to go on to the next row. I'll show you the uh, the onions. So he planted these a couple of weeks ago, a couple of hundred of them. I think, what, 200? I think about 200 onions. Uh, they're coming up nice and pretty uh, in the raised bed. Um, so we just got through planting this row in our garden, this, uh, this, this row right here uh, in Kentucky Wonder. I think we planted... Uh, two rows of uh, uh, peas the pigs did an awesome job uh, prepping our area for our corn this year so we're gonna plant this whole area here in corn we just moved the pigs around only to uh, moved them about every week and um, and they tore it up for us and everything and, and we've come back since and tilled it so they fertilized it ate up a bunch of grass and uh, weeds and that sort of thing uh, he's got all of these uh, tomatoes planted here not well not all of them he's got uh, about 25 or so planted here these are all big boy tomatoes and then he's got a few that were ready to plant um, his Cherokee purples here. So you can see we're getting ready. This area over here is uh, his carrots that he's still harvesting carrots from the one of the videos from last year. He's got a uh, big start on peppers uh, for our area. This is a this is a pretty decent start. I think he's got a. 11 of them planted so far pretty sure these are all banana peppers there may be a, a bell pepper or a jalapeno pepper mixed in but i'm pretty sure these are all sweet banana peppers we used uh, just a little bit of bone meal in the uh in the ground before we planted them he's been working on transplanting some irises and stuff over here he's got some uh strawberries planted and they're doing good There's some more onions in the raised bed over here we need to we still have to come and weed we haven't done that yet today uh, here's some more strawberries and they've got a bunch of blooms on them um, out in the uh, front pasture here we just planted some trees back last year um, there's a fig a couple of pears a couple of apples uh, blueberry bush here in the yard he just planted uh, Alex just planted a uh, a, a new muscadine a grape it's one of our grapes that we planted late last year uh, this is a uh, one that we planted early last year we still have to trellis those and I believe this is a uh, blackberry that he just planted so that's kind of what we're working on right now and uh fixing to start building some raised beds uh, for this area here uh, he's got it laid off kind of where, where he wants it all this right here will be raised beds for his sweet potatoes and, and some more root crops uh, we did want to uh give a shout out today to uncle brad for helping us with our cedar and getting it squared away uh, we had a a broken seed hopper on it and 
got a replacement for it uncle brad we appreciate you uh you and your guys getting this fixed for us it's working well it looks like working well planting beans is this all kentucky wonder or did you change it all kentucky wonder so we got uh, uh one two three rows here uh, and one row over here and then two rows of peas we still have this end of our raised bed here that we i don't know what we're going to plant alex has got an idea about that um, we've been over here watching our neighbors crazy cows this morning uh, they got several calves over here they enjoy the garden scraps everything we don't use out of the garden we feed to the pigs or feed to the cows so that's kind of the update of what we're doing uh leave it in the comments of what you guys are doing in your uh in your gardens getting ready remember to like subscribe and share it thank you